We continue our position-by-position position breakdown of the 2021 Fordham Football Rams today with a look at the running backs. The Rams have a wealth of quality and experience at the position, returning not one, but two preseason first-team All-Patriot League selections in grad student Zach Davis and senior captain Trey Sneed. Last spring, Sneed earned first-team All-League honors after gaining 175 rushing yards with three touchdowns and also catching 18 passes. He was second in the Patriot League in rushing yards per game and led the league in all-purpose yards. Davis, who missed the spring season with an injury, had a first-team All-Patriot League season in 2019 when he rushed for over 1,000 yards and seven touchdowns. He led the Rams and the Patriot League in rushing and led the league with seven rushing touchdowns. Other returning running backs include senior Antonio Cortez Feria, junior Trey Wilson, and sophomore Taj Barnes. Feria appeared in all three games in the spring, playing on special teams and also picking up a pair of carries, while Wilson saw action in two games, rushing four times and catching one pass. Barnes, who did not see action in the spring, was named Region 8 6A Offensive Player of the Year at Lanier High School in Buford, Georgia. Freshman Julius Lowridge is a newcomer to the backfield after being a unanimous first-team all-district selection at Maid Creek High School in Houston last year. Right, we're going to start, um, Zach, training camp. It's been a while. How's it feel? Uh, it feels great. It's good to be out here. I haven't been out here since uh, 2019. I obviously took the spring off. So it's great to be out here running around with the guys, running around with this knucklehead. It's just awesome. Trey, same question. How's it feel? Hey, awesome. I think me and Zach, since I got here, the one thing we always talk about, I think this was the first time that I feel like me and him were both healthy at the same time. I mean, if you see um, this whole camp, like we played off each other, like the energy has been great, and it just it's nice to see what this offense can be, especially when me and him are healthy. Obviously, it's great. You're both together. Zach, talk about uh, Trey's game. What, what, how does Trey? Oh, man, I think he changes the game. I think, we're like he said, we feed off of each other. He's a hard-nosed runner. But uh, he's also a guy that's very slippery, which is very surprising. <laughs> he's very, he's, it's, it's, it's really crazy. No, he's, he's great out of the backfield. He's really able to make plays, and, and we're so happy to have him. Trey? Sure. Yeah, about one Jackson? thing I feel like if I could take anything from him is his stride length. This man has probably the longest strides I've ever seen. Like, it's the, one of those things whenever his running style is, whenever he gashes something, like whenever he hits the hole, his stride is so long that it makes it extremely hard to hang on to this dude and he just runs every we always say this man when he wakes up he chooses violence when he steps on this field like he genuinely defenses fear him and it's going to be exciting to see this uh this fall what is in store all right the controversial question i'll start with you zach oh. who's fastest I probably, you know, I give it to you like long speed. Yeah, long speed. Long yeah, I would say speed, me quickness. Give it to him. Quickness. If we did like a five or ten. It's like my my burst, my burst is, is like my acceleration, like off the rip is pretty good. But like yeah, again, we, I just talked about this man's strides. <laughs> like he like, if you ever seen Space Jam, well like Michael Jackson's arm, or I mean Michael Jordan's arm, that's his legs. It would be it would be a tough. Yeah, it'd be a tough one. It depends how how, how what distance we're going. But uh, yeah, for sure. But we're, we're both pretty fast. You, you'll see it. We don't have to go against each other. So. <laughs> Good.